So what markets are you in, Tim? Uh, we have property in 12 different markets, mostly in the Southeast, uh, a little bit in the Sun Belt, like kind of in Texas and Oklahoma. We have some stuff in uh, Louisiana, a lot in Georgia, South Carolina. And then we have some stuff in the Midwest because I have a team up there. So Illinois, Ohio, um, <clears throat> where else? I have some stuff in North Carolina, uh, Florida. Yeah. So, I mean, it's, it's pretty much the Southeast, though. That's, that's where we like to be. That's um, too. You know, and it's just, I, I, yeah, as you guys know, it's, it's more landlord friendly. So you're not mm -hmm. dealing with all the tenant compliance and all that garbage. And, mm -hmm. you know, it doesn't take nine months or, or longer to evict a tenant. It takes 30 days. You know, if they don't pay, it's very cut and dry down here. And, um, you know, I'm from Cleveland, Ohio, which when the weather turns, you can't do any work outside for the next four to six months. That's and right. so down here, you can do work year round outside right. and uh, right. you don't get beat up by the snow and the ice and the freezing temperatures and the salt on the roads and all that kind of stuff. So it's just t property taxes are a little bit lower down here too. Mm -hmm. In most areas, Florida is actually pretty expensive. Uh, Texas is pretty expensive. Uh, insurance can be a little bit more in certain coastal areas. Mm -hmm. So you know, you're just kind of weighing out all that stuff. And a lot of people think grass is always greener. Number one reason I invest in the Southeast because I'm here, right? I live in Charleston. I know the area. I feel comfortable with it and confident with it. And, and um, this is where my joint venture partners are and uh, where I have the resources. So really, I just do it because of that. All the other stuff is kind of fringe benefits. Well, I mean, you're you're correct in the um, th these are great markets. Even the Midwest that you're in is a good market because they've always been a good rental market in the Midwest. You didn't get the um, highs and the lows. highs and lows of the values there. Mm -hmm. You, it's a, a wonderful blue collar communities. Most of the time, <clears throat> you're not going to get the appreciation that you may get in the Southeast. It just happens to be a, a hot market right now uh, because of the lower cost of living here. A lot of people are moving here, especially, you know, after the, the pandemic, people are moving to those States where it costs less to, to live mm -hmm. because they have the opportunity to work out of their homes. I, I wanted to kind of touch on you unloading a few of your, I don't want to call them problem childs, but uh, that one of the matrixes that we use is uh, ROE, return on effort. Yeah. So if I've got, <laughs> if I've got two properties that are making equally amount of money and one of them is just more of a pain to deal with, that's the one I'm selling because yep. I, I want that good return on effort. Uh, and then the same thing with, um, you know, your business in general, you have uh, people that you were, are, are in business with that, helped you get going were, were integral in getting that business off the ground and getting to getting you where you are now, but they just might not be the same fit mm -hmm. for where you're going to go. So it's mm -hmm. not just portfolio. It's, it's uh, uh, the business in general. And, and those are tough decisions to make. To and, and I think they're more important. Like, you know, it's, 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 what is the opportunity cost? I was talking to my COO today, who's at a 36 unit apartment building that has like a bunch of HUD contracts and all this. I'm like, we're losing out on millions of dollars right now because you're at this property. Either hire somebody or give the property. Like I would, I would write a check for five hundred thousand dollars to give the property away to somebody else to come in and buy it at a deep discount, so I never have to think about yeah. it again because I'm losing <laughs> millions for that. You know what I mean? So it's I'm, just, I'm your buyer. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, you don't have that. You don't have time for that either. 